Force India revealed its 2010 car on Tuesday, the VJM03. There were no covers to come off though, as it was all launched virtually via the team's website. Adrian Sutil lines up alongside Vitantonio Liuzzi once again after the Italian stepped up from the reserve driver role to replace Giancarlo Fisichella for the final five races of last year. Scotland's Paul de Resta is the team's newest recruit. The DTM driver takes on that reserve job and will also be driving in several Friday free practice sessions on Grand Prix weekends. Fissi Keller is no longer part of the team after agreeing to become one of three test and reserve drivers at Ferrari. The latest Force India, the third car for the team, which has been known in the past as Jordan, Midland and Spiker, promises to be the most competitive yet. It's powered by the same Mercedes engine you'll find in the back of the McLarens and the Mercedes Works cars and could confirm the team as a solid midfield runner, especially as four new teams are joining the grid this year. Team principal Vijay Malia is adopting a Kaizen-like approach of continuous improvement. Sentiments echoed by Sutil, seen here shaking the car down on the Stowe circuit at Silverstone. Well, you always want to improve your results. So my, my aim for this season is to be competitive throughout the season. We want to start strong, we want to end up strong and uh, be consistent in the points. I think that's the main main aim what we have. Um, if there is a possibility to go on the podium, we're going to see. I mean, we don't know how the car is at the moment. We have good hopes, we are optimistic, but um, it's a little bit too early to say where we're going to end up. But a top 10 results, consistent, that's, I think, uh, the biggest aim. Jerez will be the venue for the new car's first test outing of the year on Wednesday, with the Utsi driving for the first two days before handing over to Adrian for Friday and Saturday.